my channel. So today I have a Valentine's Day decor tour. I just wanted to introduce myself real quick. I see I have a couple of new subscribers. So my name is Marlene. This is Life with the Miles. I do cleaning videos, vlogs, hauls, anything, you name it. I do them. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you do, don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. And let's get into this tour. So I'm just going to give you a quick little overview of my living room. It's nothing crazy. It's just a little bit of decor. To start with this shelf up here, I just had this wooden basket. Usually I'll put like a little sign inside of it. I didn't find anything else and honestly, I don't really decorate that much for Valentine's Day. So I just left it plain like that. I feel like it still looks good. And I just had this sign that says, welcome to our home. And the little um, bobblehead Valentine dog. I think I got that from Dollar Tree a couple years ago, if I'm not mistaken. Then I just had this EXO sign that I got from Target Dollar Spot a couple years ago. This Happy Valentine's Day sign that I got from the Target Dollar Spot as as well a couple of years ago. And then I just had this XOXO sign from the Target Dollar Spot a couple of years ago as well. And then over here on my couches, I just have red pillows that I always have out. And then my home pillow that I got from Walmart. Coming over here, I just have this little sign that says the best is yet to be. I have those two little hanging animals, the little teddy bear and the monkey that I got from Dollar Tree a couple years ago. And honestly, I'll show you. They look better when they hang, but I liked how they looked right there. If you put them like this, they hang off. Now on the next little level, I just have that love sign that I got from the Target Dollar Spot a couple of years ago as well. This lower level, as you can see, I don't have anything. Like I said, I keep it very minimal when it comes to Valentine's Day. Over there, I just have like a little gray blanket so for when we're on the couches. Then over here in my lantern that I got from the Earth in Hand with Magnolia Collection, I think it's called. And in here, I just have these red heart picks that I got from Walmart. That little hippo is actually uh, nine years old. I got that from Walter nine years ago on Valentine's Day. And then I just have this little heart dish that I got from the Target dollar spot. Those pink heart lights I also got from the Target dollar spot. This pink flower I also got from the Target dollar spot. All of these things were like three dollars. And then I just put this little candle that I got from there as well on that cupcake stand at the Target dollar spot as well. And this is just a little overview of my eating area. So then you come over here. Now my th three tier tray. I just have this M that I got from Hobby Lobby. This pink dove I got from the Target dollar spot. The pink succulent that I also got from there as well. I'll show you how it looks all the way down so then coming over here this heart I think I got this from yeah the Christmas tree shop for $1.49 unfortunately one of my birds from the Target dollar spot didn't last but it works out great because I just do this put that heart to the side and I lean the little bird right in there. And then I just put this little cupcake stand in there. I was going to get like a little pink tea light, but I haven't gotten to it. And I just wanted to put this video up for you guys. And then just coming down here, I just have this pink mug from the Target dollar spot. As you can see, everything is from there. This white little rose is from there as well. The picks are from Walmart. Succulent from Target. And the little house is from Target as well. Then up here, this banner. I got it a couple of year go, years ago from Target. This dish comes with the other little dish that I had in my lantern. This was actually full with Valentine Day colored chocolates, but we've been eating them. This little floral arrangement was actually made from a Christmas flowers from Walmart and I just cut them up and just took the um, pine cones out and left these white berries and the pink flowers in it and then I just have my regular home sign that's there and then uh, 
Actually, I should have put a pink candle there, but I want to use that one up. The blueberry waffles. And then now here in my kitchen, I just have that banner right there with the hearts from Target. That mitten, oven mitten, is from the Christmas tree shop. And then coming over here, I just have these little towels that says, You're my cup of coffee. And little coffee mugs with hearts and snowflakes from the Target dollar spot. And then I just keep this little towel right here to dry my hands. It says, What's cooking good looking that I got years ago from Kohl's. So I really don't use it for decor, but I keep it there to dry when I use to dry my hands. And then I also forgot to show you right here in my living room is that I just have this little sign that says Love Shack on it. And it's right next to my TV. So as you can see guys, I just kept it very mi minimalistic. And for my room, I just have this less cuddle sign. But that's it for the Valentine's Day decor. I didn't do my bathroom this year. Like I said, I wanted to keep it minimal. I wasn't going to go all crazy because after Valentine's Day, I decorate for spring. So keep on the lookout for that one. And I hope you guys enjoyed this decor tour. And if you did, like I said, give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe down below if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.